friends good morning welcome to my channel balu master today i am going to discuss shortcut number 10 on differentiation yes friends looking the question is very big if y is equals to root over x minus 1 x minus 2 x plus 3 whole y x plus 4 x plus 5 x plus 6 then what about dy by dx yes friends this kind of lengthy and complicated questions also you have a shortcut formation friends definitely i'll explain the shortcut formation after completing the procedure look at carefully the procedure friends first so whenever this kind of questions will be there friends you have to take logarithms on both sides so if you take logarithms on both sides what happens friends taking taking log on both sides if you take log on both sides log y is equals to this is what friends logarithm of this total part whole to the power of half means that is of the form log x to the power of n that's what n log x friends that is of the form log x to the power of n so log of root that is what log of this total part whole to the power of half that is what 1 by 2 into log x so we can able to write 1 by 2 into logarithm of x minus 1 x minus 2 x plus 3 whole line x plus 4 x plus 5 x plus 6 then what happened this is now let us simplify this one log y is equals to 1 by 2 times of c log a by b that's what it is of the form log a by b what is the formula for log a by b log a by b is equals to log a minus log b that is the formula friends log a by b is equals to log a minus log by log b so that's what you can able to write log of x minus 1 Into x minus two into x plus three minus this minus log of x minus x plus four into x plus five into x plus six. This is equals to still simplification is there one by two times of this is what log a b c. What is the form? Log a b is equals to log a plus log b. Similarly, log a b c is equals to log a plus log b plus log c. log of x minus 1 plus log of x minus 2 plus log of x plus 3 minus so log of a b c can be expressed as log of x plus 4 plus log of x plus 5 plus log of x plus 6 so this is equals to 1 by 2 times of log of x minus 1 plus log of x minus 2 plus log of x plus 3 minus log of x plus 4 Minus log of x plus five, minus log of x plus six. Why? Because minus into plus minus as well as minus into plus also minus. This is what log y. Now what we are going to do, you know, friends, differentiate with respect to x. Dif If you apply differentiation, friends, what we get here? D by dx of log y is equals to one by two times of. So d by dx of log of x minus one. Plus d by dx of log of x minus two, plus d by dx of log of x plus three, minus d by dx of log of x plus four, minus d by dx of log of x plus five, minus d by dx of log of x plus six. This is equals to log y derivative is one by y into d y by dx. This is equals to one by two times of log of let it be call x log x derivative is 1 by x function of function x derivative 1 constant derivative 0 1 only plus log x derivative so log is there here okay log x derivative 1 by x again function of function 1 of course log x derivative function of function again 1 minus symbol is there log x derivative 1 by x same function of function 1 minus 1 by x plus 5 function of function 1 minus 1 by x plus 6 Now this is what one by y dy by dx. Now you want dy by dx value. Dy by dx is equals to y sent this side. That's what y by two. So y by two means what is the meaning? One by two into y. Y is what friends? Y is equals to square root of the given question. Square root of just to copy this one. X minus one. X minus two. X plus three. Whole by x plus four. X plus five. Into x plus six. Bracket begin. One by x minus one plus one by x minus two plus one by x plus three minus one by x plus four minus one by x plus five minus one by x plus six. Friends, that's all your answer, friends. This is the method, friends. Now I want to give the shortcut. Within one step, we can able to evaluate this kind of questions. 
any number of functions are there in the root no problem you can able to do very very easy friends now i want to reveal the shortcut look at carefully friends if y is equals to square root of a of x into b of x into c of x into d of x whole by e of x into f of x into g of x into h of x e f g h of x so like that any number of multiple functions are there no problem friends your shortcut is very very easy so what you are going to do means dy by dx can be written as first of all you have to copy 1 by 2 into you copy the same question friends a of x into b of x into c of x into d of x whole by e of x into f of x into g of x into h of x you copy the question into what you are going to do means sir just whatever first function is there apply derivative by f a of x plus apply derivative b of x plus apply derivative c of x plus apply derivative d of x whatever denominators are there keep negative sign that's all numerator positive signs denominator functions negative signs so minus e dash of x by e of x minus f dash of x by f of x minus g dash of x by g of x minus h dash of x by h of x that's all your shortcut formula friends it look like it is very big problem but if you simplify it, then that is very very easy friends look at carefully friends i want to apply here only dy by dx is equals to 1 by 2 is compulsory and square root of the same question you copy friends x minus 1 x minus 2 x minus x plus 3 whole by x plus 4 x plus 5 x plus 6 into very very easy it's a dash of x what is the derivative of x minus 1 1 x derivative 1 constant derivative 0 by x minus 1 numerator values keep positive this derivative 1 by x minus 2 this derivative 1 by x plus 3 minus y because denominator values same like derivative of this one 1 by x plus 4 minus 1 by x plus 5 minus 1 by x plus 6 that's all your answer friends it is very very easy friends just hardly 5 seconds hardly 5 seconds you can able to evaluate the given question friends coming to multiple examples friends if y is equals to square root of of course quadratic given no problem friends if it is quadratic also you have shortcut so what is the shortcut here friends 1 by 2 is common it is square root of copy the same question x square plus 2 into x minus 1 into x power 5 plus 7 whole by 3x square plus 2x plus 1 into x minus 5 bracket begin derivative of this x square derivative 2x by x square plus 2 numerator that's what plus x derivative 1 by x minus 1 x power 5 derivative 5x power 4 by x power 5 plus 1 of course this is in numerator that's what plus sign next coming to here this is a denominator part that's what keep on negative sign so 3x square derivative 6x 2x derivative 2 constant derivative 0 by 3x square plus 2x plus 1 minus because this is also in the denominator that's what negative sign x derivative is 1 by x minus 5 that's all your answer friends coming to next question friends if y is equals to square root of x cube plus 3x square plus 2 into x minus 1 by x into x square plus 2 into x plus 1 then what about divide dx 1 by 2 into square root of copy the same question x cube plus 3x square plus 2 into x minus 1 whole by x into x square plus 2 into x plus 1 now what you are going to write x cube what is the derivative of this one 3x square plus 6x whole by x cube plus 3x square plus 2 numerator part plus x derivative 1 by x minus 1 minus denominator part x derivative 1 1 by x minus x square derivative 2x by x square plus 2 minus x derivative of 1 by x plus 1 that's all your answer friends hardly it takes 5 seconds friends this kind of difficult questions lengthy questions also we can able to do in a shortest way that's all friends so that's all for today's class friends thank you very much friends thanks a lot bye friends